If you're from the South, you may be familiar with the process of blackening fish. It's one of my very favorite ways to cook just about any freshwater fish, but especially fish like crappie that has a lot of natural flavor. Now don't confuse blackened crappie with black crappie, which is a species. There's black crappie and white crappie. Blackening can be done to just about any fish, but specifically boneless fillets. It's a method where you apply a lot of spice directly to the fillet of the fish. Usually you don't use any sort of batter or milk or anything else. You just season uh, a lot of spice directly on the fillet and then you pan fry it in butter. It's called blackening because a lot of times this spice, usually it involves cayenne or something with a little bit of heat, it often burns in the pan and especially when you're cooking it in butter, sometimes this butter creates a bit of a char on the outside of the fish. Now with something as light and as thin as crappie, a lot of times you don't have to cook it long so you don't actually get a char even though this method is still called blackening. The method of blackening fish is incredibly simple so most of the art comes down to what exact spice blend you're using. Today I am just doing this the quickest and easiest way that is fantastic where I just use Tony Saturi's seasoning, just a nice spicy Cajun salty seasoning and then pan fry it in butter. Of course, I always use cast iron. You primarily use butter in the pan, but you can also throw in a little bit of olive oil or avocado oil, anything else to help give the flavor a little bit more complexity. Either way, you're probably going to end up smoking up that room pretty good, so turn on the vent hood, open a window if you have to, and get cooking. You just want the fish to be flaky on the inside and browned on the outside. No reason to overdo it, especially with a fine fish like crappie. You probably only need about a minute, maybe a minute and a half per side. You're going to want to flip this with a spatula, not tongs, because often you're doing this with light flaky fish that fall apart when you try to flip them. So hopefully you can try this after your next fishing expedition, whether it's crappie, white bass, redfish, even catfish, blackening is a great way to cook just about any fish in the south. I hope you enjoyed this cooking tip. Make sure to like this video and subscribe so you can see actual adventures of us on the water catching them. Until next time, stay safe, be free, and never stop seeking adventure.